music and masks. You'll find plenty of both at the Bishop Arts District. People are enjoying being outside. Where small business owners like Ken Valencia of Bishop Street Market welcome a new Dallas County order requiring businesses to post clear signs telling customers they need to wear masks to enter. It really just helps us and it helps further the economy now that we can feel safer about being out and, and shopping in public. Every business I saw here in the Bishop Arts District has that message displayed somewhere on the storefront, but the 303 Bar and Grill actually takes it a step further. They'll take your temperature as you walk inside and they'll even give you a mask if you don't already have one. Small businesses aren't the only ones going the extra mile. Galleria Dallas is also offering customers free masks. General Manager Angie Freed says we distribute several thousand masks daily and we're asking our retailers to enforce the county's mask policy policies within their stores as well. But the new countywide requirements didn't come without controversy. County Commissioners J.J. Koch and John Wiley Price spoke out against the proposal, saying it should be up to individual businesses, not the county government, to decide whether to require masks. We just don't want again to, you know, to be the heavy hand of government. Gary Huddleston of the Texas Retailers Association told commissioners most members support the requirements, saying shoppers are more likely to comply with a countywide order than a store policy, which will reduce negative interactions with customers. You stop people at the front door, there's a, sometimes there's a conflict. Take this video from police in Cedar Hill. On June 6th, police say an employee asked a customer to step outside because he didn't have a mask. The surveillance video shows the man shoving the worker to the ground. While physical violence might be rare, Valencia says disagreements do come up, even at the Bishop Arts District. We've had a few people who have their own ideas about uh, not wearing a mask. And he's relieved most customers were happy to abide by the new rules on Saturday. I think everyone has really been supportive and actually very appreciative that the mask directive has been put in place for our safety and the safety of our customers and the safety of our, our employees. In Dallas, I'm Eric Alvarez.